This is the National Sickle Cell Center, Lagos. It is the first of its kind in all of Africa and was established by the Sickle Cell Foundation of Nigeria, a not-for-profit organization dedicated to the treatment, care, and support of people with sickle cell disorder. Over the years, the foundation has been able to ease the plight and agony of persons living with sickle cell disorder. One in four Nigerians are carriers of the sickle cell gene. Nigeria is the country with the highest burden of sickle cell in the world. 150,000 babies are born every year in Nigeria with sickle cell. And sadly, 100,000 of them do not live to celebrate their fifth birthday. If you can wrap your mind around that, that's a chilling statistic. And this is a statistic that we are trying to reverse here at the National Sickle Cell Center. With support from the MTN Foundation, the Sickle Cell Foundation of Nigeria runs dedicated sickle cell clinics in Kano, Lagos, Delta and Edo states providing free life-saving drugs for the patients. The National Sickle Cell Center provides a number of key services from state-of-the-art laboratory services to genetic counseling, leg ulcer treatment and prenatal diagnosis to mention but a few. Contrary to popular thinking, there is a cure for sickle cell disorder, bone marrow transplantation. 50 Nigerians have successfully undergone the procedure in Rome with the support of the Sickle Cell Foundation Nigeria in partnership with the Italian government. Before the transplant, my son was 45 kg. He was the smallest in his class, but after the transplant, he's bigger than me now. Right now, after one and a half years, his weight is 72 kg now. I just wanted to thank the management and the staff of Sickle Cell Foundation in Diaraba, Lagos, Nigeria, for the wonderful job that they did for me and for others. If not because of the effort of what they have done, I don't know. The pain my son was going through was terrible. Now I can allow him to go to school. Bone marrow transplantation makes a huge difference in the life of a person with sickle cell. These pictures also speak for themselves. Our big project is bone marrow transplantation. This is the cure for sickle cell. And I'm glad to say that we are championing this in Nigeria so that it should be locally available and accessible to Nigerians here in Nigeria. I'm glad to say that um, the Lagos State Government, through His Excellency, Governor Akimumi Ambode, have made substantial contribution or donation towards this project. And um, we're looking to other Nigerians to step up to the plate and make this a reality for us. Work is in progress at the proposed bone marrow transplantation unit. After completion, the center will serve all of Nigeria and Nigerians will no longer have to travel abroad to access the service at exorbitant costs. The doors will also be open to Africa as a whole and even beyond while boosting medical tourism in Nigeria. That unit will be between us and Lut. It's being built in Lut because bone marrow transplantation is not an easy thing to do. And when you do it, you have to destroy the bone marrow of the recipient. And at that time, that recipient is very prone to disease, infection, and so on. It's got to be cared for in a hospital 24-7. The Sickle Cell Foundation of Nigeria, the National Sickle Cell Center and the proposed bone marrow transplantation unit are Nigerian projects. Let us work together to ensure their sustainability so they will continue to serve generations of Nigerians yet unborn in fulfillment of the Foundation's founding mission of bringing hope to the African child. Hope. It is that shining beacon in the horizon, a promise of better things to come, hope that the smallest of us, when given a chance, can live to their fullest potential. Visit www.sequelcellfoundation.com to donate to the proposed BMT project.